Yo, finally, 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 we have got to a point where we are bringing awareness to things and we are bringing them together with real storylines and making things positive in an impactful way when it comes to our sneakers. And I think this sneaker that we're about to release are one of the most iconic sneakers that you could ever release. So we're going to talk about it. Y'all know how we do it. Let's get right to it. Roll my camera, please. Yeah. What's good, Camp Crew? It's your homeboy, Camp Quarter Banks, and welcome back to the channel. Now, if this is your first time tuning into my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, notification bell, hit that like button, and drop a comment down below and let me know you rocking with the team you dig. Now, today we are talking about some new dunks that we'll be releasing today, actually, November 4th, Friday, November 4th, and this is the Why So Sad Dunk. I think that this is one of the most iconic dunks that you could actually create and release to the world. I think at this point in time, we are going through a lot in this world and a lot of people are dealing with a lot of mental stress. So we got the Why So Sad Dunk and I just want to talk about it and show y'all why I think this is one of the most fire sneakers. So with that being said, let's go, man. Let's talk about it. Now, just to get right into it, this sneaker is going to be releasing for $1. 20 so you're gonna get the best bang for your buck and i think that this is a good price way especially for a dunk that's this meaningful now for those that are wondering why so sad why it's named why so sad this is a sneaker that's built to bring awareness to mental health and suicide prevention now the reason why i think this is so far is because there are a lot of people that are going through things that we just don't understand we can't see it when we walk past them but we just don't understand what type of mental health they're going through and to have something like this is a sneaker that's meant to uplift your spirits and if you have something like this you'll also see that you are a part of a group of individuals that's actually going through the same thing now hopefully when people are buying this they're buying it for the purpose of what this shoe is about instead of just buying it because they feel oh this is a dope sneaker now from first view just looking at the shoe entirely i think i like this full colorway that they have on here they have a number of different blue shades on here and they have that playful child's play color type of red and yellow that's combining with this so it has like a youthful look to it and i think that's fire now getting into the outer sole i think this is fire it's a clear outer sole it's that gel clear outer sole usually i would see like a blue one but in this case, I'm glad they didn't go with blue and they went clear. It's like a transparent level of color that starts to merge in. You'll see that it starts with the clear, moves up to the white, and then goes straight to blue. So I think it's a pretty dope idea that they started off with it. Now, not only is this so like clear at the bottom, you'll also see at the bottom, if you flip it completely over, you'll see that they have that red emblem that's in the middle where it says Nike, of course. And I think that's kind of eye-catching. It's something that's small, but it's minor, but it's also clear with detail that they're really trying to stick out with some things and trying to catch your eyes when you're moving your feet on the ground. Now, moving up to the midsole, I think that clear white that's on there, I think it was a smart idea. I like the blend from the clear to the white. That's a solid transition. I think that is a great idea for what they're doing at the top. So you didn't really need too much that's creative at the midsole to try to catch everybody else's attention because moving up, that's when all of the fun starts to begin too. Now, as you get to the upper, like I said, this is where all the fun begins. And right off the back, you will see that there is shades of blue on here to have something that's moving from this buttery leather to move into a softer suede that they have on here. Now the soft suede that you see that's not the swoosh, you'll have everything else that's in that dark blue colorway, that navy blue colorway. It's all a soft suede and I think that's a mature look to go from a softer suede to going to a smooth leather. That's a good transition as well. So all of this shoe is all about moving in transition. So this is a perfect play on colors. Now, just to stay on the upper, you'll start to see some graphics that's on here. You'll see an embroidered graphic that's on the back of the heel and on the inside of the sole. You'll start to see these graphics everywhere. And that design is to keep you reminded to just continue to move, talk, and ask yourself, why so sad? Now, although this shoe is one of my favorites, I think the swoosh on here has to be my favorite thing that's on this shoe. It's a wear away swoosh on here. So it goes from that dark blue to a light high yellow that it starts to fade into. So that is a creative idea because it's just a symbol to show all of the emotions that we go through. We go from one emotion to another and we have to get ourselves back to that happy stage. So it's going from being in that blue to moving to a sunnier yellow side. And I think that's a great idea. Shout out for executing this properly. Now, as we get to the tongue, you'll see that we have that Nike SB that's in red and we have that yellow or that yellow 
Which Gold. That's in Nike SB. And on the inside of that sole, you will actually see Sad, which I think is perfect because they don't just have Nike plaster everywhere. They actually have more of the idea that's plastered everywhere. So you have Sad that's on the back. You will have Nike that's on the front of the tongue. And then on the back of the heel, you will actually see a question mark with that rough suede that's in red. And you will see the yellow that's stitched in embroidery yellow. I think that is great. Now, I don't know how many laces come with this shoe, but I actually think that if they just stay with this right here, this white that they have is spot on. You don't even have to add anything extra, but if you wanted to, adding like some yellow laces or having gray laces will be a perfect idea. Rare will be something cool, but I think it'll be too hard on the contrast and everything like that. But like I said, this white is just perfect. So it blends with the midsole and the outer sole fire ideal for the yellow laces. Now again, I think this is a iconic shoe. I really do think that this is something that stands the test of time. You could tell this story over and over again. And after the year is over, you could still bring this up for years on end. Five, 10, 20 years later, you could still talk about this shoe and and actually show people why this is bringing awareness to mental health and suicide prevention. This is really important case that a lot of people are going through and this is going to be something that helps a lot of people around the world. Whether you think it or not, it actually does. I love the color theme of this. The price way is perfect and I love the idea of the entire shoe. So this here, this is the, my first 10 out of 10 that I've given for 2022. This is a 10 out of 10. This is perfect. Nothing needs to be touched. Nothing needs to be updated. This is a fire sneaker. Now, I know we always talking about sneakers and fashion, but I do want to say for those who are going through any type of mental health situations or they're dealing with their mental health and they are struggling with things like that, I want you to know that you could call that number that's listed down below. You can reach out to the website that's also listed down below. And listen, it is okay to not understand what's going on and it is okay to ask for help. The big part about this is actually asking for help, taking action and asking for help and seeing that you could get to that brighter side and being happy again. Now again, you will have everything listed down below, but with that being said, I'm your homeboy Cam Quarterbanks. Thank y'all for tuning in. I'm finna get up out of here. I appreciate y'all watching as always. Y'all already know the vibes, man. I'm out. I'm gone. I'll holler at y'all, man. Be mentally strong. Peace.